Jay Middlemas on Virgin Radio. We are backstage once again in the inner sanctum. That is the artist's area. This is access all area here. And we are with the lovely Rick Witter from Shed 7. Hello, Jane. How are you? I mean, it's... Look, it's really posh, isn't it? I mean, it's literally... It's uh, really posh. Yeah, it's... it's. You should see what's behind the camera. It's Des- incredible. Look at it all going Describe on. it for our listeners, <laughs> well, Rick. I don't, I I don't mean, think I'd be allowed. I'd get I'd get arrested. It's like it's like a boudoir in here, isn't it? <laughs> it's just like a Parisian boudoir of goodness. <laughs> a boudoir. I've not heard that word for a long time. Um, I've just got to say, Rick, uh, I came in here and I've just got to... I've got to stand up at this point and say... Congratulations! Mm. The first band I've seen with any alcohol in their dressing room. And probably that you'll see all day, so you're welcome to tuck in if you want. I don't actually drink one. So I, right, I can't, okay. but I was I was very I was very, very excited to right, see. Right, well that. I'll tell you what, I'll try my hardest to do it in for you then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, you have just come from a festival. This is festival season for you, haven't you? Yes. So this is uh, a busy summer, so we played trans not transmit, we played Tram lines. Tram lines, yes. That's funny, isn't it? Because there is a transmit as well, isn't there? Yeah, we were Tram there lines in Sheffield we played yesterday. And then a four-hour drive down here yesterday that turned into about a ten-hour drive oh. because of diversions. But that was all right because we had a few of those on the bus. Oh, with us. Rick, so I, c- I mean, were you not sick? No, just a bit sick of travelling, but not physically sick. How do you do it these days? I mean, because, you know, w- because none I'm of really us... Old. None of us are, well, we're all, we're all getting on a bit, you know, (laughs) but how do you guys manage? Are you still sort of like living the rock and roll dream? Yeah, definitely. And I think it's very important to uphold uphold those kind of laws that uh, when you join a band, you're expected to do. I'm 50 this year. (gasps) How are you feeling? Are you going mad about it? No, I don't care because I feel about 22. Honestly, I've got children who are older than how I feel. Um, if that makes it, it's a great lyric, isn't it? Um, but festivals are good because you get to do a hard weekend and then you get a few days to recover. Yeah. Because that's always just, just as important as the recovery process. But you're going straight on holiday after this, aren't you? Yes, I am. I booked a holiday in festival season. Silly me. <laughs> so, <laughs> so half my family are already there and I'm going to hot foot it after this today. Oh. So it's quite good that we're going on so early. We're, we're on as special guests. So if anyone's just waking up, you better get to the field quick because we're going on soon. I mean, it is literally you're on today. Yes. And you are you are gonna be. What day is it? Exactly. Is it Saturday? Exactly. Okay, it's Saturday. I am so mm. confused. I've been here quite a long time now. Yeah. So you're on today, and so you're gonna be on the main stage. So you're gonna be welcoming everybody, and it's the it's. I mean, I'm not gonna say this, Rick, right? But I'm gonna say it. It's the best day today. Is it what yeah. artist wise? Yeah. Right. Okay. I've not so actually looked, but I will have a look. You're literally welcoming in the, the best day. The best. Brilliant. Yeah. That's the it. Best. It's when I woke up this morning. It's all I ever wanted. <laughs> Was it? And it's happening. It's like Christmas, except it's July. But yeah, uh, as long as people come and watch us, or the people They're that do will. come and watch us will probably enjoy it, and that's and that's all you can hope for and you aspire to. You got all the hits in there. Well, this is the problem we have with a festival set because we're playing for an hour, so that equates to Ooh. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten songs. So it's really difficult for us. Very, a very fortunate problem, but we have discussions on what we can't play because there's no time. So what do we drop? Uh, but it's a, gr- it's a happy problem to have. Yeah. I mean, it's m- miles better than having a set where you think, well, we've not got enough songs to fill it. Yeah. So you're not allowed to see that anyway because that's. That's for. Is it's that a, it's a surprise. Secret? It's a surprise. Okay, that is. A, that I is do shout outs for people in the crowd. If they tweet me and ask, can you give me a shout out? I do that. Do you so, do shout outs? So I've got one here. Will you give me a shout out? I can give you a shout out. Will you? you? I can do. I'll write it on my little little oh note God, thing Rick, here. If you did me a shout out from the main stage, I would. I think I would explode. So, so I don't know this person, but someone called Amy on Twitter. Yeah. And it's not a real name because she's actually called Lisa, but a, a <laughs> Twitter name is Amy eight eight three eight one one zero eight. Okay. And she's asking me, she's saying, it's a 27th time seeing us today. Wow. But the first time seeing us in daylight and sober, so please don't be rubbish. 
So she that's didn't, what she wants me she to say. She actually didn't say rubbish. She actually She didn't, swore. did she? She did, but, but I, I'm, I I'm thinking... You. I love you I'm for just thinking I'm enjoying that. this interview and I want it to carry on. <laughs> now, once I've started on that, it might be a different story. <laughs> so, um... We've got to be quick because you've got to limber up. What do you do? Yes. What's well, your pre-show uh, routine? I shake my hips and do pace, do an awful lot of pacing. Is it like a Jagger thing? It is because I'm a bit like Jagger anyway in the yeah. respect that I like to throw Move. some shapes. Moves and it's weird like when you've just got off a bunk on you on the bus and then suddenly you're playing in front of loads of people doing that. So, yeah, from about now, I'll get the oil out. Do you do, you do any yoga, Rick? No, I don't do that, no. I mean, I'm a big yogi. Really? So, yeah, right. I would I would suggest to put in some real gum in the set, maybe. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. okay. Right. I'll, I'll do a bit of research online and see what <laughs> see what I can do. <laughs> well, thank you very much for speaking to us. Have an amazing show. Thank you, Jane. Thank uh, you very much. Really looking forward to seeing you. I'll give you a shout-out. Give me a shout-out on the main stage. That yeah. would be amazing. I shall do just thank that. Thank you.